Additional audio evidence um, of uh, Root Cannon, um, TU Law Lecture Root Cannon, discussing being abused by uh, failed blogger John Ryan has been re-uploaded to Odyssey. Um, I just figured I'd start with that one, considering it was it was a point of um, perjury, a very deliberate point. Um, there is about four or five, maybe eight more audio um, where Root Cannon discusses uh, physical and psychological and financial abuse by John Ryan. Um, then there is also the um, audio where uh, Root Cannon fakes being mugged. Um, this is a variety. Um, all of that's going up. You can find them on the Odyssey account. Um, the link is in the description. Um, they also these are being posted to Reddit, um, and there's uh, an archive.org. Uh, no, there's two archive.org accounts, um, and uh, yeah, like um, so. If anyone wants more of it, it's all going up. Um, the phone calls tracing back to root um, all the way back to. Um, January 2021 and, and further are all going online and uh, they'll all be um, free for people to sample or whatever uh, as they go on. Um, um, I, uh, some of them I might chop down um, to just say where Root Cannon is talking about Michael Hanaho being senile or um, how Eva Laller in the... Um, Free legal aid is an idiot, or uh, you know, um, obstructing uh, reporting. Uh, the um, uh, ex head of housing and welfare, Terry Madden's child abuse, um, which Terry Madden has admitted under oath uh, uh, in recorded phone call. I mean, I can't can't get any more admitted than that, but uh, still, Root was obsessed with it. Um, just like the way her and John Ryan. Um, and in recorded causal show, uh, are obsessed with uh, paedophilia and um, child murder cases, which is um, particularly the, the, the smaller, the younger children, the better. It seems to be that was what uh, Ruth um, continually talked about. Um, so, you know, uh, running, running um, obstruction for someone trying to report historic abuse um, is a bit puzzling in all of that but it seems to fit with the character um so those calls will go up as well um i think there's a i think root gets particularly um uh there are nighttime calls when root would get obsessed with that stuff so i'll, I'll try and separate them into day and night calls um yeah so this is me uh documenting um root cannon the uh, coercive controlling um abusive a uh, lunatic barrister who destroyed my life, or what was left of it, um, and then tried to murder me. And has committed perjury, really easily showable perjury on the stand in Ireland. Um, and uh, isn't, isn't going to get away with that at all. So yes, follow the link in the description to the audio. Um, and... Uh, why it's important? Well, um, Root Cannon gave a completely uh, fraudulent version of events, not even a fraudulent version, a completely imagined narrative of, of, of the previous few months. Um, and some of that involved uh, John Ryan, allegedly her partner, I don't know. Um, uh, he's a little bit of a stalker himself um, since we've met recently. Uh, and uh, he... Um, you know, the, uh, as Root's testimony was regarding that, um, and, uh, you know, they haven't been able to scrub the whole constant, John, Root constantly asking me, did I want to speak to John, which never made any sense, I, you know, this weird Trump light QAnon pedophile obsessed nutbag was anti-vax as well, and he, and, uh, the, like, that, that was, was very confusing for me, but, Again, why this is important is it um, further goes to show uh, uh, Root Cannon's perjury on the stand. And um, <laughs> every red letter was, uh, was, a, was a lie. 
Um, so I'm just recording this slightly longer because, um, uh, you know, I know some certain people uh, have to listen to them the whole way through and um, also there's a lot to say really. Uh, I just, uh, at the end of the day, want my life back from these people that wormed their way in. Um, John Ryan telling me I'm not disabled and such like that, you know? You're not disabled. He's a weird little um, hiss of a voice. Um, and... Uh, What do you do? Like, Ruth Cannon tried to murder me to block a civil case. That's the core of this. She was caught committing defamation. I've proved that she was that she was lying. She she repeated Ruth Cannon repeated the lie about the tipex in the court again, thinking that the, the audio is gone or something. I don't know. Like this is this is like such buffoonery. Um, but. This is what TU Dublin Law is standing behind. This is what Andrew Bradley is standing behind. Like, the audio is already online. Root literally deliberately as part of the DAR, the digital audio recording in court, made reference explicitly to um, me losing my temper or the, my, the rage that I experienced uh, regarding tipex on legal documents. Well... Aside from her being obstructive and it contradicting her at the exact time in court. <sighs> there was already audio online. So, you know, what you're witnessing is just terrible fraud and destruction of a person. Um, with a diet-obsessed narcissist. Um, failure of a barrister who's a bloody lunatic. And her anti-vax... <laughs> abusive boyfriend like this is what the law society is protecting anyway the audio you will find on odyssey <laughs>